But first, that big soap news that we promised you. After 20 long years, iconic soap Brookside <gasps> is coming back to our <gasps> screen. <laughs> Very excited about this. Classic episodes will be available to watch for free on the 1st of February via the streaming service STV Player. Uh, so, of course, Liverpudlian Soap, famous for pushing the envelope with its controversial storylines, launching the careers of Sue Johnson, Ricky Tomlinson... Anna Frail. Anna Frail. Was there any others? I, was there... Yeah, any? Uh, I can't think of anyone else. <laughs> no, I can't think of anyone else. You should know. <laughs> To think what they went through then, what we go through now. Never changes, you mean? Well, everyone's hard up, aren't they? So why should we be expected to take a cut in our wages? Why should we pay for bad management? You can consider me on strike. What do you think they're doing at number 10? Must be a mad chef or something gonna live here. Anyone want tea? Catch up with close friends. Brookside from the very beginning. Honestly, that, that uh, fills me with so much pride and happiness and I'm so looking forward, as a fan of the show, to just watch it from the beginning. Cos, again, we were all a lot younger back mm. then, <laughs> so it might be, make, make more sense in some ways. And, and the, the stories and the topical, you know, storylines that they had were just so ahead of their times and relevant and still relevant. And I just I applaud STV for, for, for re-showing to a new yeah. generation and to the ones who yeah. remember it. Yeah. I genuinely loved it. It was really part of my routine. I always remember, because I loved the omnibus on a, a Saturday yeah. night. That was my thing. So and maybe it was a wee bit delicate on a Saturday morning. You know, it's like, <laughs> I got up late. Went to a step class. Remember those? Yeah. 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 Had a coffee with my friends or whatever. Did a bit of shopping. Home for just after five o'clock to see Brookside, watch that, and then go out again the Saturday night. So it was just really part of my kind of life then. Mm. I absolutely loved it. I really did. You know what? For me, I, I remember it on a Thursday for some reason. Oh, yeah, well, it was during the yeah. week yeah, as and well. The music would come in, and usually it was around my bedtime, and I used to just, yeah. And I used to just, <laughs> I'd just go in between my mum's arm and just sit there quietly because I knew if I didn't say anything, didn't move, she'd forget I was there. <laughs> And it would go past my bedtime and I could watch the first 15 minutes, but I don't know what happened. As soon as that break went on, she was like, oh, got to your bed. So <laughs> it was like, but yeah, it just brings me so much nostalgia. That It's just a song. And then I'm like, I'm sitting next to someone oh. who's a legend and was in the show, that's which so, is like uh, iconic. Well, that's such a nice thing to be remembered for, because I remember when Brookside was on, you know, it, there was it had its good days, it had its bad days, and it wasn't always loved in the press. Not mm. everybody applauded it for what it what we say it was good for now. Yeah. So it's great to know that it's, it has got legendary status mm. and that it has stuck with us. I mean, um, uh, you think stories like that, I was a fan, I loved it. You know, I was are you still in thing. touch with some of the cast? Oh, yeah, some yeah, of them yeah. are. And of course, if we bump into each other, we're always so fond of like just yeah, remembering story, how yeah, close yeah. we were. And we were in Liverpool, very much away from the London crowd. You know, we were just having, we were all very normal, if that's the right word to use, yeah. you know. Everyone didn't go to drama school. I didn't go to drama school. They, they gave people a chance to be in television that were plumbers, electricians, just normal job in, you know, mm. the public were yeah, allowed yeah. to be part of a really important soap I opera. I don't think we saw you um, that much in that other clip. We've got another clip that we're going to see you. Oh, God. Better. Really? I, I mean, yeah, I was yeah. 15. I've only just come in. Are these what you're looking for? You can make a start on the orange juice. It's over there. Right, check the price on here. 27 pence, set your gun. You're paying attention or what? Now you know why my haircut matters so much to me. <laughs> you don't look, look any different. Hair. You look I'll exactly the same. Stop it. I was 15. You were 15 in that? I was 15 there and I didn't know what I was doing. Then I came back when I was 25 looking like that as the same character but a nurse. And yeah, a little bit naughtier, but um, still, you know, a scouse representation of a girl that hadn't been seen on telly before because yeah. we didn't get to see many Asian scousers. In fact, we still don't see many Asian scousers, to be honest. So mm. I feel like I was really lucky to be one of the first to be on screen seen as that. So yeah. Ooh.